for transparency's sake, uh, this is not an ad. Although developers, pay attention. Yeah, this is not an ad. Uh, just want to promote some cool indie games and again help you trophy hunters get some badass trophies. So if I'm not mistaken, this is, I want to say there's 11 gold trophies and one platinum. So that's awesome by itself. Um, if you have multiple versions of the game, it's stackable. So if you have a North American version, uh, you can get a platinum there. If you have a European version, there's a platinum there and so on. I'm going to do like I always do, send out a quick tweet real fast, wait a few minutes, and we'll get this party started, folks. I want to thank anybody and everybody who's joined me in the last couple of days. I've been doing a lot more streaming here lately, and uh, what was it? It was yesterday. Yesterday we finally got the Sigi speed run. Got my 54th platinum. Today I'm going for my 55th. Oh hell yeah. Oh yeah. You better believe it. Yes, this game is available on the store. I want to say it's $5.99. So it's pretty cheap. But um, again, it's a good game for what it is. So. Alright, I see we got people hopping in, so I'm going to go ahead and get it started and tell y'all how to walk through this wonderful game known as Storm Boy. Welcome everybody. Welcome everybody that's just joining in. Alright. So it's a semi-story game. You could read all this if you want. I'm not going to. I'm just going straight for the trophies. All kidding aside, it is a really good story. I suggest you do read it if you do play the game. So we're coming up on our first trophy. I mentioned it earlier, but all the trophies in this game are gold. Except for the platinum, obviously. Okay, so this one, uh, you just fly around as a bird. You just basically got to play a bunch of mini games. That's how this is set up. So we're going to start this one. And the trick to move him back and forth 15 times, a trophy should pop up. And we'll be moving on to our next already. God, I love easy platinums. <laughs> 55th. Y'all are witnessing history here, folks. <laughs> Video game history. All right. I look at that little pretty bird fly. Look, look at him fly. He's he's so graceful. I will say this, this is like one of the more zen games I've probably played in quite a while. Boom, there we go. Born to Fly trophy. <coughs> Excuse me. Once you get the trophy, just back out, and that's it. I mean, that's you're pretty much seeing what the rest of the game is made of at this point. Alright, here's our next mini game. On this one, we gotta get uh, 20. Uh, what are they called? Conch shells? Cockles! <laughs> and you can see them really easily. You just go to each one. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Get you 20 of these bad boys. And that'll be yet another gold trophy. You're welcome.
nine more. What are you doing over there? We, we got a guest in the studio today. <laughs> Playing some Farmville. Farmville. What is it? We'll give the game a shout out real quick. It's not Farmville. What is it? Experiment Island. Experimental Island. That sounds safe, don't it, kids? All right, one more cockle. And that should, bam, there you go. Another trophy. Back out of that one. Oh, uh, look at the little penguin. Oh, uh, look at the little guy. I should have speed run this one too, because this one I probably really could have done in 10 minutes. Oh well. Oh, look at the little pelicans. Stormboy picked them up and carefully, oh, getting ready in time. Two of the baby pelicans were fairly strong, but the third, oh, getting ready in time. All right, now this one, you can get two trophies on this mini game. Uh, first off, you are going to feed fish to all three of these dudes. So let's try to get Come on, you in the back there. Come on, we know you want one. Hey, up, oh, yeah. All right, so yeah, get one fish to every pelican. That should unlock a trophy. And then we're gonna get the pelicans mad at each other. And that will actually unlock yet another gold trophy. Come on. There we go, fish magnet. There's the first gold. Now we're gonna do another one. Oh, hold on, shout out to Toby Wayne Kenobi. What's up, dude? Thank you for dropping by. Oh, it's all good. Don't, don't worry about that. Oh, you're excited for the Resident Evil 2 remake. You and everybody else, Toby Wank. God, that comes out this month too, don't it? Holy shit. All right, anyway, sorry, getting off track here. Um, on this walkthrough, once I have fed all three of them, now I'm gonna try to get them mad at each other. So I'm trying to fit, I'm to work. You'll start seeing the other pelicans shaking their heads. Yeah, they're getting mad now. I'm gonna do three to the right over here. And when they all get mad, you get, I think it's called Hangry Bird. The Hangry Bird Trophy. One more, this should do it. Yeah, Hangry Bird, it's awesome. Okay, so back out of that one. And we're on to the next part. So peaceful, so zen, so relaxing. Great game to play on a Sunday. Come on, kid. Chin up now. What are you looking all sad about? See, there he is. All right, we're coming up our next mini game, which it's either the raft or the yeah, it's the raft. So what we're going to do is we're going to hop in on this raft 
what you want to do is turn all the way around and you're gonna see some boats out in the distance go towards those boats now you can't obviously go all the way there but go as far as you can to this net this barrier whatever you want to call it and go ahead and hit triangle to go diving what you want to do is you want to dive to the bottom of the ocean floor this this mini game's got two trophies as well just like the last pelican game so go to the bottom boom got the adventurous trophy and now you just want to stay here this is literally the easiest trophy I think I've ever got in my life. I'm showing you my controller right now. I'm showing you my controller right now. I'm just gonna stay here for a second. And when the boy starts swimming back up, another gold trophy is gonna pop. Wait for it. But yeah. I got all day. I can do this all day, folks. All day long. Boy, good thing I'm not holding my breath under this water. There we go. Trophy. And then you just back out of that one. God, this game is easy. God bless you developers for making these easy platinum games so I can exploit them. And show all of you wonderful people how to exploit them too. Alright, next mini game. Draw something in the sand. Oh, I can think of a bunch of dirty things, but we'll just we'll just go ahead and just do it quick. M M. Good old mullet Mike was here. Bam. And then back out. And then literally back out and you get a trophy for that. I'm not even kidding. We're almost done, folks. <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed this stream so far. All right, on this mini game, you just got to play fetch with your pelican. Throw the ball out there three times. One. Go get it, buddy. Go get it. Yay! He's so good. You like my pelican, don't you? <laughs> I've trained him well. Second time. Come on now, we don't have all day. And third time is the charm. Should make the next trophy pop. Here we go. Boom. Commitment. Something Mullet Mike is not afraid of, folks. <laughs> now, as we move along this sad, depressing, sandy shore, there's another mini game here. There's technically not a trophy in this mini game, but you still have to at least start this mini game for a trophy later. I know that sounds confusing, but bear with me. So like, just start this mini game. Just go sled down the, the depressing, sad beach. And then back out. That's all you gotta do right now. But that'll come in later, you'll see why. <coughs> Excuse me. Now this will probably be the toughest trophy in the game, but that is really not saying much. The controls can be a little finicky on this one, but it is not bad at all. You have to fly your pelican to said ship right there. Those poor, poor bastards. So on this one, you just kind of got to keep your pelican centered. It is a lot tougher than it looks because the wind's kind of blowing you in all different directions. You just got to keep them centered, 
get them to the boat. It's very sensitive, but when you do it, bam. Trophy, our hero. And that should be the hardest one. <laughs> Saved by a pelican. God, if I had a nickel for every time that's happened to me. Alright, we're actually getting to the end of it, folks. From the start, Mr. Elk oh, couldn't read it. But most of all, he flew round and round. The, oh, couldn't read it. Before long, the ducks understood. Mr. Percival oh, couldn't read it. Oh, no. That's where it gets real sad. Yeah, what a dick, huh? Don't shoot it! It's Mr. Pers- Oh. Oh. Oh no. Spoiler alert! <laughs> oh, he's- He's in birdie heaven. How weird. Just, that's right, Mr. Percival, just fly to your little perch there. Now we just go up to the ghost of Mr. Percival, your dead pelican, which is perfectly normal. Perfectly normal. And this should trigger not the last trophy, but should be the second to last. Aww. This is a good game, though. Good story. And there it is, trophy earned. For birds like Mr. Percival, do not really die. Pretty sure they do, kid. Hate to be that guy, but... Yeah, circle of life and all. Bye bye, birdie. He was like, fuck the other two pelicans. Mr. Percival was the only one I cared about. Alright, and that was the game. Like, that was it. So. This is the last trophy, and then the platinum should pop. So you gotta remember, and what you gotta do is this trophy just asks for you to pretty much replay every mini game, but you don't even have to replay every mini game. Watch this. I'm literally, literally gonna start and back out of each of the nine mini games, and that should pop the final, final trophy, which will unlock the platinum again you're welcome I remember I remember Mr. Percival he was a good pelican Andy Dufresne was my friend he crawled through a river of shit you know, I accidentally hit a story part it's all good Say so this is why you had to unlock this one earlier, or else it wouldn't have been in the remember file. Boom, there we go. I'm like, God, I love some good old easy trophies, and I love showing you guys some good old easy trophies. If you'd like to keep track of my trophy hunting achievements, you can check it out at psnprofiles.com slash xmulletmike. This will be my 
155th Platinum. Thanks to all y'all. Thanks to all y'all for supporting and watching. A lot of things can be said about me, folks. Nobody's gonna say I'm a poser, though. This dude games. All right, I think this is the last one. Let's see. Should have a trophy pot. We're gonna find out. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, ghost bird. There we go. We got the remember trophy, and if I'm not mistaken, platinum storm boy. Bam, right there. Just like that, folks. <laughs> I don't have the time going. I didn't see how long it took, but my guess 20 minutes to 30 minutes and that's it folks there is your easy platinum trophy for storm boy which is a really good game in its own right i gotta give it credit it is a good game in its own right definitely worth 5.99 holy shit definitely but i think that's gonna do it for me today folks Thank you all so much for watching this quick little trophy walkthrough, achievement walkthrough, whatever you want to call it. I appreciate you joining me today. I sure hope you all enjoy. I am Mullet Mike with the Sticky Paddle and Full Screen saying keep it sticky, stay creepy. Thank you all so much for watching. Wait for it.